Roar, I'm a dragon, but I breathe ice instead of fire. <laughs> All right, so I didn't record me putting on my base coat because that would get really repetitive really quickly. But I did record me putting on not milky white, which is the white base for this entire look. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at it. Now, if you're going to actually attempt this, you're going to want to use a regular long lasting base coat and not a peel off one. Because like Simply Neological said in her video, Using a peel-off base coat increases the chances that the nail polish will peel up and that the entire look will be destroyed. So don't do that. That's also especially important to keep in mind whenever you're doing a nail look like this because it takes like four hours to get it all done. I'm telling you guys, I did not realize the time commitment that I was going to be sinking into this look whenever I started it, but here I am and here I be. <laughs> All right, I'm just doing a second coat of Not Milky White now just to make sure it's nice and opaque. I like to do two coats of it. Sometimes you have to do three, it just depends. You are too slow, Prince. We're already onto the cleanup. Okay, I get it. I'm just using a cleanup brush dipped in acetone. I mean, come on guys. Not even princes can be perfect. Although I, of course, come pretty fucking close to perfect. Just kidding. <laughs> now it's time for me to apply Simply Peel like it's no big issue. <laughs> Copyright Prince Lacquer. Except that I didn't realize until after I'd already applied Simply Peel that I forgot to record it. I just didn't press the record button. The camera was in view and everything. I just didn't press the fucking record button. I'm so smart, y'all, I'm so smart. But you can have some shots of Simply Peel after it's already dried up and crusty on my nails. Okay, enough of that. Time to look at the polishes we're gonna be using on the gradient. Oh, they're so pretty. Look at my beautiful bottle pornos. I worked very hard on them. I even cleaned the tops of the bottles with acetone to make sure they wouldn't look disgusting! Now I'm going to apply all of the polish to a latex-free makeup sponge, which I did not clean. Time to sponge that shit right onto my nails, and we still have two more gradients to go! <laughs> and of course, I can't forget the peeling off Simply Peel shot. I'm sure you guys want to know what's on my other hand! Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba it's literally just not Milky White. And now we will be taking a brief ASMR peel porn intermission. Yas, girl. Simply peel like no big issue. Yas. Yas, 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 Okay, fine, I get it. I'll shut up. I'm back, and now it's time for us to apply a nice thick coat of Glossy Taco. This isn't optional, by the way. You have to apply these in between every grate to make sure it dries up nicely and that there's a nice surface for the nail vinyls to grip onto, okay? So do not skip this step. If this streakiness happens to you too, don't worry about it because it will be covered up by the other gradients. Allow all of that to dry for 20 minutes, and guess who came up to see me while I was waiting? Hi there, pretty. Hey. Hi, my precious, my precious. Oh. <laughs> Hello, dear pretty. Hello. Hello, my beautiful precious. Okay, it's time for us to apply some nail vinyls. These ones are the Chevron Minis from Twinkle T. I'll link them down below. And if you have nails with a strong C curve like I do, make sure you really get them into the corners like I'm doing here now. That way, no polish will bleed up into the previous grading that you just did. But be very, very careful not to dent the polish. Once you've got all of your vinyls applied and ready, it's time for some Simply Peel. That's right, more Simply Peel. Make sure you get the sides of your nails for easy cleanup like I'm doing here, and let's get the top- Ugh! Usually, I have no problem with big globs of white liquid, but this is disgusting! If this happens to you, it's a sign that your bottle of Simply Peel needs to be cleaned. Don't be a nasty bitch like me! Now that that mess is out of the way, make sure to let Simply Peel completely dry before continuing. It sparkles when it's ready. Fuck off, I was bored.
Alright, now it's time for some more latex free makeup sponge action dabbing on the nails stuff. Oh! And this footage comes free with some peel porn. Oh my god, oh my god, so beautiful! But you know what's even better? My candid reaction to my pointer finger. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Also, I'm just gonna brag a little bit here and say that this is my first attempt at a triple scale gradient. If you have managed to get to this level, do not skip the top coat. This is what the quick dry top coat was meant to do. Let it serve its purpose. Okay, now let it all dry for 20 minutes. And I know that sounds like a long time, but if you're a possum like me, you will definitely enjoy this time because you can sit there and watch Simply Press Start, or maybe Ants Canada, and get grossed out by roaches, or get turned on by Alex from Stardew Valley. The choice is up to you. However you decide to spend your drawing time, please be careful with your nails and probably don't attempt any of the things I'm doing in this b-roll shot. You can still watch your favorite people, but probably don't try to eat popcorn and point at them and all that kind of crap. Okay, so now that it's been 20 minutes and not a second less, repeat the placement of the nail vinyl and of course simply peel underneath, but just make sure and position it very carefully because you're gonna need plenty of space for this next gradient. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm actually doing this. My Simply Peel bottle was a little bit more appropriate this time, which was very nice. So we're going to allow it to dry, I guess. But I'll be fucking watching you, Simply Peel. It's time for the last gradient, and oh my god, I am so hungry. I'm so hungry right now, it's been like three hours. But we just gotta pull through a little bit longer, guys, just a little bit longer. <laughs> this was a horrific angle for this shot, but oh my god. Oh my god, guys, I am a dragon. I am literally a dragon. Let's see that one more time, shall we? Because, oh my god, that was just so satisfying, I just can't get enough of it. Oh. Oh my god, y'all. I'm literally a dragon right now. Don't forget to seal in the dragon scales with a nice thick coat of glossy taco. And guess what, bitch? You're done! You can finally eat something now if you want. Just be careful not to get into your mom's jewelry box and start eating jewels since you're a dragon now. Thanks for watching this pilot video of mine, I really do appreciate it. And if you liked it, please go ahead and give it a like, it really would help me out since this is my first video and I have no clout. I'll see you guys next Saturday and hope you have a good weekend. Bye!